That's the best part of the clam right there. I got a little bit of squid on there too. It's probably gonna come right off, but it leaves a, a nice residual cloud around your your offering to the fish. Right, look at a big one. That bait. It's a darn good piece of bait. Must be some storms coming this way. So, anyway, I'm gonna go walk down and see what we get here. Looks familiar. We got a good rip. We're gonna fish the rip out there today. And tree way rig going. And we got some good vibes going here. Got a good feeling. I think they I had a porgy over there earlier. So maybe we'll get into something. We'll be fishing a rip out here. See if we can see what we tie into. Let me bait up, get some clam, got some squid, and gonna get started. Got some clam, got some squid. I'm gonna cook them up. Some good vibes. See what we get. We'll start somewhat small today. So maybe we'll try strips later, but I'm gonna go quick chunks something like that give this here a good old shot maybe we'll get a big old forty I think we will I think we will we got one hook on but yeah that looks good that looks good Don't have a rag though. No rag today. Where they could be, and I'm getting some bites now, I think. So maybe we could use a little bigger hook. Okay, I think we got him. Is he on? Oh, we got one. We got one. What is he? Oh, that's a that's a little porgy. We want to get a bigger. What the heck happened here? We want to. Big porgy, that's what we're looking for. But we got life down there. And although we are fishing bait, we are actively fishing bait. In other words, I'm casting, swinging, and retrieving. Just like if it was a lure, except there's a piece of bait on the end. If you were working a bucktail, you'd be doing the same thing. Just swing it across, right across the bottom. Waiting for that big bite. We have any? I like the way that rip looks. It's up here, coming in now. I think he might be a porgy. One of the smaller porgies. Got a long way in. Ooh, it's a raindrop. It's not, it's not a storm on the beach. Let's see if we see that silvery goodness or. Ooh. Yeah, he's got a porgy. There he comes. Oh, he's a little bigger. So we're getting porgy today. Oh, he's filled too. Something bite. Very cool. Get him on his way. Great view of the city here. I was on the beach earlier and there were storms rolling through and there was nothing going on. So I got out and I was gonna go somewhere else and I was driving by here. I was like, you know, the sun's gonna be setting. And not too soon, we got a few hours to fish, see what's out there. So I said, you know what, I'm gonna give this a shot over here. And this is what we're doing. Just take the day as it comes, how the day goes, and we'll make the most of it, like we always do. Oh, well, they're in, they're in. Let's see how big this guy is. We got some little porgy. We're looking for a bigger one, we're looking for a bigger porgy. They're out there. 
they've been hitting the bait so far. We're picking them up. Got some good water. Let's get him on in. This was actually, I was, I was on the beach. We had some, what is he? That's one of those sea basses. You want a big, you want a school of porgy. These guys are all over east, west, north, south. Ocean. Take a cast out there in the rip. Now, what am I talking about? The rip. Let me get a cast. There it goes, right in the rip. Um, but the rip, what I'm calling a rip is, you see that change in the water over there? There's something on that bottom. It's probably cut off. So there's the disturbance, and that disturbance, that's where the fish are going to kind of be feeding. You can see it's all kind of different, all kind of different. I think any kind of difference. All right, we got something just as the ferry is coming through. Maybe it's going to be a porgy. Very cool. Here comes the ferry now, and here comes our fish. Oh, he's pulling, he's pulling. Let's see if we got a really calm day today. Not many people out. Oh, he's digging, he's digging. This feels like a good one. There's the ferry, here comes our fish. Wow, whoa, 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 whoa. This could be a keeper porgy. Let's see. I think I can give it a little more. Oh, yeah, he's pulling. And on the bottom, you want to keep that off. The bottom will fish him way, way out. Let's keep that lock tip up. Keep the tip up. Come in, take a look at him. See what he's all about. Here he comes. Wow, it's a big porgy. Big jumbo porgy. Beautiful. I didn't bring the cooler today. Maybe that's the secret. <laughs> yeah, he's 12 inches. You guys want dinner? I don't know. <laughs> dinner? Got a couple of hooks here. I do have ice. That's eight. So eight. He's well over twelve. I'm gonna keep him. I am sure someone will be happy. Get a few. Oh, here's my ice. Thanks. Part of the channel memberships, and with that is, I'm just growing on that. And I kind of like it now. I was kind of skeptical at first, but you're going to get an exclusive video, and I will probably do more. And it's going to be personal. It's going to be. To see rants raves you can see me discouraged you can see me happy um you hear me talk about things that i don't talk about uh you're gonna get a lot of member posts you're gonna get extra video on top of that one i'm gonna try to do it'll be shorts it's gonna be no frills kind of i'm not gonna put in many placards not gonna get too in depth but when i get in depth it's gonna be tight um and i'm gonna keep the group tight um so in other words at this price get so many people um i want to keep it tight so i can keep it personal um get to you get to your questions i don't want it big i want it small and i want to put content out there that i don't normally do so um check it out and uh join. it feels like he could be a little bigger is he a porgy i think he is a porgy he's going to be a little bit bigger. I don't think he's a jumbo. Though. Certainly not. Maybe he's a porgy. Let's see. That's what we're looking for. Big porgy. Oh yeah, he's a porgy. 
They're getting rainy, a little bit bigger. Okay, they're getting bigger. They're getting a little bigger. Looking for a big one. Maybe for dinner. Got a porgy on now. And let me show you how I'm rigged completely. And I'm fighting through these here little guys. Hoping to get a dinner porgy. It's kind of drizzling on and off. I was at the beach earlier. And I got out of there. I came down here. Let me show you how I'm rigged here. Of course there's a that stood the old three-way rig. Um, got braided line, my pen beach master. It's a pen torque rod. That was for a while, not a bad rod. The important part is here, a braided line to my connection lot. That's 30 pound mono. Um, one thing when you're fishing like this, I do like the mono because you can just tie right up and it never ends. That's 30 pound surgeon knot to my braid. I'm going to run that down. You can go longer or shorter. Another surgeon knot to my hook. Overhand loop to my sinker. A little, little bit off the bottom. But that's the rig. I think I got some wind or some big. People think it'll get a good big one in this cast. Make it a double dinner. We'll see. We'll see. I think they're to the left. Find out now. Right where I want to go. Get it down. Let's see. I think they're in there. If we get one big one, we'll get a few more big porgy. They kind of definitely come in school, so they will bite at night. We'll get a bite soon, I think. Let's be ready for him. Some good bait on there, so. Where are the porgy? Okay, I think. Okay, I think we're in them now. Get a little slack. Hit a little. Thing. The big ones will just slam in. There we go. There we go. Let's see if he's a dinner size porgy. It was bigger than the other guys we did. Yeah, he's a big one. This could be a dinner fish. Feeling it out in there. Let's see if he's a big porgy or a little porgy. He might be definitely bigger than those other little guys. Let's see. That's the one thing with these beach bastards. They don't have the best gear ratio. Alright. Got dinner. Dinner porgy. Way cool. Let's get a measure. That's eight. Should put him at ten. We're gonna let him go. That's a dinner size for you. It's gotta be ten inches. So that's eight right there. I got my let bring the cooler. You guys hanging out or leaving? Yeah. You want them? I have one other. He was like over 10 inches, but I don't have a ruler. But his, he's about 12, I think. Oh, thank you, Robert. Yeah, you got it. You got it. Thank you, you get any more big ones? Or? Uh, well, only one nice size one. And All I'm right. They may have somewhat of a dinner then. Yeah. yeah. Right, if I get another one, I'll give it to you. I was going to keep them if I got two, three, but, you I'll know. Yeah, you. yeah. You Enjoy. Channel? Yeah, yeah. What's the name? Oh, Fish Your Way. Fish your way? Yeah. Okay. yeah. yeah. Alright, I'll, I'll look it up, man.
Yeah, yeah. You right if I get you in there? That's fine. All right, cool. My name's Jerry anyway. Terry? Terry, nice to meet you, Jerry. <laughs> you guys have a good night. Hey, we got a couple of nicer porgy today. Fishing through the smaller porgy. And that's all the part of bait fishing, especially when you're fishing from shore. Using clam is good bait. I've got one. There's a little guy coming in now. He's one of the bigger little guys. And I'm gonna hang out. I'm gonna hang out till the sun sets. That's what I like to do. Beat the weather today. And just having fun. Pretty much so all you need here. Maybe buy a soda over here, you bait over there. And uh, you're fishing. Good stuff. Has had a good bite. I just love this. Beautiful colors in the sky. I'll come back. Come back, Papa. Come back, Mama. Where are you? That was a big one. Come on. Slack. I took all my bait. Okay, we got one. Oh yeah, it was a good one too. Come on. Hold on. I think I've seen some snappers coming through. I was just at a mile in the sunset. Wait. Oh, he was a bigger one. Maybe we had a bigger one. Maybe we got off and maybe we picked him up. All right. 